All right, welcome everyone. We're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we're here for School Rumble, Rumble season, season one, one, episode four. four. We had archery, we had sleepovers, and now it's time for... Aikido. Aikido. Yeah. Yes. And more importantly, side character romance stories. Yes, indeed. Well, romance stories, however that goes. But, because you know, Yakumo will not be romanced. Nope. No. By no one. Nobody is yeah. worthy. She's got too much on her plate. Mm -hmm. She's too responsible, needing to take and care too of her much on older Tenma's sister. Plate. Well, I don't know. Oh, oh, yes, I get it. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. I was going to say, I was like, responsibilities? No. <laughs> she's thick and she has to Actually you know, putting a ton her, of food you know? on Tenma's plate. Right, yeah. Right, uh -huh. exactly. Just yep. like, please take care of my poor, dumbass sister. She wastes so much energy on God knows what. I have to keep her fed. <laughs> yeah, 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 exactly. So, all right, y'all, without further ado, let's get into this. Ugh. Yes. Yes. <laughs> Gets extremely close, yeah. I love this, like, wait. Legend of the Galactic here. Yeah, I was style. just gonna say, like, at yeah, first yeah. I was like, oh, it just reminds me, and then I'm like, wait a minute. This is actually a reference, isn't it? It might be, but I doubt it. No, but that would be perfect, because <laughs> with those, with, you know, uh, Yang and Reinhardt, oh, it's yeah. the, when are these two gonna meet? <laughs> Never. <laughs> when are these two gonna meet in the middle? Never. At the beginning of one of these episodes. In every age, in every place, the deeds of men <laughs> remain the same. Oh my god, yeah. <laughs> oh no. That's not a lot of money. Recreation? <laughs> what? Where does he think they're going? Hey, Pookie. Don't get your hopes up. Yeah. <laughs> it's all going to be gone before the bus even departs. Right. And he stops too early. Yep. Yeah. Oh, you're gonna go try to sit next to him after he's already sat. Okay, go yeah, for it. The true power play. Mm -hmm. Holy shit, yes. Right, she sat opposite him, and then he wanted to sit op next to her, but he couldn't, so he sat opposite yeah. her, and now he's in the way. I carry <laughs> Right, and it's specifically Harima, who's so big he will absolutely block the view. Oh no, and then she's gonna be like, why don't you sit next to me? So that she can, yeah. All right, All right. this is gonna chance shuffle to up switch the seats. seats. Yeah, yeah. uh-huh. <laughs> mm. All right, early bird gets the seat, let's go. Hmm. Wait, so that means it's probably already... All the seats are full. Oh, oh no. my god. <laughs> Fight them off. Yes! Be free! Uh, animals now. Yes! Mm. All right, now ride the piggies. Ride the piggies to the other bus. Oh my god. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that extra, like, power behind it. I'll go sit next to her. Wow. You you are the least frightening. <laughs> oh my god, yes. Keep this gag going the whole right. episode, please. 
All right, so next is a plane, obviously. <laughs> She's Toko. <laughs> it actually worked. Now yeah, I feel carsick. <laughs> Yep, yep, I was gonna say, you were making the same motions. Mm hmm. Yeah! Oh no, the consequences of my actions! Yes! Yes! Wait, how did you get to, like, New Mexico no, or something? I, yeah, or Australia. Yeah! <gasps> ah, Yakumo. Oh, yes, because her sister isn't around anymore. Oh, oh no. Damn it. Okay. <laughs> Hang on. No, she got such a good workout. <laughs> no, she's dead inside. How could she be in love? Right. Oh my god. Alright. I right, better not run into your true love along the way. Wait, how'd you lock the door from the outside? I mean, she... clearly that means that she has keys. Right? <laughs> yes, it's psychic. It speaks to me. <laughs> yeah, I mean, that X on its forehead is... It's a cursed spirit, clearly. Run! She's a ghost and a bitch! <laughs> the cat's just not into you! Yep, just waiting for you to leave, yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> ah, wind in my hair. Oh, the cat's following her! Oh, okay. Oh my god! Maybe this cat is psychic. Mm -hmm. She just doesn't realize how popular she is. It's such a oh. fatal flaw. Yeah. Oh no, we have a whole new group of friends. Yep. The narrator. <laughs> oh. Oh my god, yes. Yes. God, this is funny. Perfect! Yeah. Right. If anything, that had to be real awkward. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Hmm. Ah! Ah! Perfect. Oh! Shocking! <laughs> yep. Oh my gosh. And she can see the future, basically. Yeah, yeah. Right. Then he's gonna be like, you know what? Will you teach me? You're truly a master. Yes, that's true. Oh, but you shouldn't have said Talk that about, shit my, about sister. my sister. Yep. Hmm. Hmm. Oh no, she's gonna. 
Oh no. The first time she's ever yeah. ruined a meal. Could it be love? Was she distracted? Oh no. It's what you asked for. You have saved me from my curse. <laughs> I'd like to thank all the producers and for... the voice cast. And... No, no, no. He's granted you psychic powers now. Mm. You can now read the minds of all that love you. Oh, fuck, I'm about to die. Please let us hear the cat's thoughts. Yeah. Please. <laughs> what is this drama? Ouch. Ah, yes. I heard the thoughts of your meow meow meow. Yes. But okay, now we're certain to go full Psyche K. Hmm. Poetry. See, I was expecting something. I was always waiting for like that level of like a bridge comedy to, to step in. <laughs> but no, it's a love story. Hmm. Ah, classic. Yes. Classic. And we know Karasuma never forgets an umbrella. <laughs> we cut to Sukamoto breaking her umbrella. Mm. Of course. And that's why she's breaking it. Mm -hmm. Just over her knee, just snap! Sudden super strength. Wow! This is my one chance. Deploy! Yeah. Yes. You think... <laughs> oh no! Yeah, and he obviously has an umbrella. Oh. You're hitting yeah! Yes! <laughs> this unit is incapable of feeling pain. Wait. <gasps> oh! Oh my god! This Chad. They set it up! From the beginning! Yeah. That when this fucking trope would get used! Uh -huh. Oh my god. Yes, he's built different, yeah. Mm. Oh my god. He's gonna god. share, he has an extra one, and he's gonna give it to you. Yes! Kick reason to the curb, mm -hmm. do the impossible. Break through to tomorrow. Okay! I feel like the show just geosed me. And like, as soon as I saw that, I felt the neurons in my brain like, <laughs> like shifting. Clearly, Jacob. The, the, the show is trying to make you dumber. You just need to like, it's working. your brain. I just know, right? That one joke, I feel like it just, like, if it was a shooter game and my brain is the target, it just got, like, critical direct hit. 
<laughs> Mortal damage. Yeah. Just Permanent. a hole right through it. <laughs> yeah. Permanent loss of HP. My brain is actually reeling from that. Mm. Ready. Yes. Oh. 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 Oh, well, okay. <laughs> All oh, right, oh, let's go. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 and a oh. physics teacher. Perfect. Uh -huh. I'm ready for some physics to get taught to me. Okay, that was indeed a that... series of jokes that we were given. Indeed. And that was indeed a joke to end the episode on. Yes, and yet so much of the... The episode actually felt like it was trying to be serious. Yeah, well, it was trying to do a drama with regards to Yakimo. Yeah. And while and we did have the school trip, that was funny. Mm -hmm. That was really funny. I, I very much loved the gag of Karima just, sorry, Harima, yeah, constantly being like incapable of rejoining back with the school trip. Oh, yes. All it, the stuff with Yakumo was like, wait, what is this? Is yeah, she like, has psychic powers? She's like, Is this going to be an ongoing thing? Are we bringing superpowers into this show? I think it has I, to be, right? Maybe, like, like yeah. this might have been a one-time thing. Right, we'll have to see with, like, future, like, episodes, whether, like, the cat's there or, you know, whether mm. she reads minds anymore or things like that. Mm -hmm. She is such a reserved character that we might not know for a very long time. Right. Because, you know, actually getting a first-person perspective with her was pretty different just True. in and of itself, regardless of the telepathy. But, okay, I, I, I mean, I liked it. I liked the idea of it. Um mm -hmm. Comedy then sidelining you with something serious is one of my favorite experiences with stories. So, you know, <laughs> yeah. You were not sidelined here, though. I mean, come on. Like. Yeah, no. It, like, it, it felt more like it was like, okay, we're doing a comedic bit, I guess. Like, yeah. I, 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 it was a skit bit for Yakimo. <laughs> yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Like, like I did not take it super seriously at all. Oh like, no, no. The it, if anything, the the thing that was funny was something that I imagine the show wasn't necessarily intending to be funny uh -huh. as the main part of it. Right. Which is the ah yes, all these people are going to obsess over this girl. Her only flaw is that she doesn't know how perfect she is. <laughs> like that, that, yeah. that definitely gave me some chuckles. Not in the way that was probably intended. Nope. But, but hey, she gave it a fair shot and actually asked him to share the umbrella. Yep. I gotta way say, to go. this is the biggest mm -hmm. win you've had, basically the whole show. And this outside is, of the love letter. This is where you actually just go and knock on heaven's door and basically say, God, what the fuck are you doing? Because, you know, you you should have gotten it here. This was some like divine intervention. You cannot have any progress with him. And so reality rewrites itself yep. to be this. Yep. Like this that. was the reality can be whatever I want episode. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Like, like it's the point where the player just looks at the DM and is like, really? 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 Yep. Okay. They're all immune to fire damage now? Well, all right. right then. Well, then! Yeah. <laughs> you haven't seen the last of me! Yeah, yeah. So I will, I will very much... Uh, mm -hmm. throw all hope and abandon it to the side and I'll just join Griffith in the holy city. Yes, and, you know, pave your cobblestone road. Yeah, yeah just mm -hmm. surrender myself to be I a sacrifice them all. And to be sacrificed and I, I will, I will, I will. I mean, I let's be real. Let's be real. I no longer want to struggle. If we had a Behelet. I don't wish to be horny anymore. If we had a Behelet and all that was standing in our way was these characters. <laughs> I sacrifice. <them laughs> I all. sacrifice. <laughs> that that would actually I, be a good test. I might hold out a little bit for Yakumo, just yeah. because of the, like, this is oh, a lot okay. of bullshit to deal with from your yes. older sister. Mm -hmm. But, wow. Yeah. What, a, yeah. what, a, what an incredible, incredibly this was, silly episode. This was really something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I Like, as we keep watching episodes, I feel like I get an understanding for the vibe and the thought process behind the show. And the you creator. Know? Like, yeah, and, yeah, and the creator. Mm -hmm. and, and I... I like it. It's like, time traveling for sure to, to go back to that space. Yes, yes, yes. And and I think that's probably one of the bits of where 
people could have trouble with this show mm-hmm. if they were to watch it nowadays is yeah. that if you're not as familiar with like the jokes of anime from back then uh-huh. you know like just just uh Karasuma as a as a character yeah. I feel like he's just this wonderful debunking of the harem protagonist mm-hmm. except realistically if you had a potato protagonist he wouldn't be the character at all he wouldn't be the main character at all and no one would really be interested in him other than I guess the one you know dumbass dumb girl character. yeah right who who just you know imprints everything on him when there's literally like nothing, nothing. there you know nothing. if anything what we got from him this episode you know and and showcase granted, that he does have some personality he, he does have some personality we've seen bits of it over the course of the story but when it's he gets not to be the recipient of the reality rewriting of yeah the exactly but it's nothing that tenma is like it's those are not the things that tenma likes about him no. right you know it's well it's, she did say actually because of that little thing, that's why I like you. She literally sure, said, "That's okay. why I love you." So that's All right, that's okay, actually that's not fair. true. Like <laughs> that's fair. Yeah, his randomness and his ability to surprise. <laughs> he definitely does do that. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Wow. He is a god tier bicyclist or cyclist, mm-hmm. and he is very into kappas. Yeah. So he became a kappa. Mm-hmm. Yes. All hail the mighty kappa. That's right. Yes. But he wasn't the one that developed psychic powers, which was surprising to me. I, that was a bit surprising. Although I think it might have, I think the psychic powers might have come from the cat. Yeah. Because the cat had the had yeah. the had the mark, and it yep. was following her around at school. And it did say specifically this day yes. she was able to read the minds. So I think it's because the cat followed her. Yep. And it was a shrine cat too, so yep. it fits mm-hmm. the bill in that regard. Right. Although I will say, Mr. Aikido, who wants her to join the club, I love his addition in that the joke with him was that he thinks exactly what he's saying out yep. loud like mm-hmm. like there's there's nothing there's no duplicitousness in him at all right it's like that one step down from luffy where it's the it's not that there are no internal thoughts you know it's that no it's just the you, one internal thought yeah there, there's no filter step by step by step uh-huh yep. never never right. uh showing any sign of uh, dishonesty mm-hmm. yeah we love it i mean hey there, there you go you know if you're like hey i just want this girl to join the club because think you'd look really good in the outfit mm-hmm. and he says it out loud yeah to mm-hmm. everybody yep unashamed all, and confident and all just... the school was like cheering him on in some ways almost or yep. like being like no how right. could you yeah exactly uh-huh and it, it wasn't even like the i want to be in physical proximity to you when we're like training or anything it's the nah you would rock this outfit mm-hmm. you'd be badass mm-hmm. hell yeah yep but apparently she doesn't need to learn anything because she oh, your adopted it all from useless. there. Mm-hmm. And, uh, yeah. you know, while she uh, uh, got upset about him saying that her sister was slow, mm-hmm. it is true, though. And See, while we are not going into Siskon territory... No, and I appreciate I that it I appreciate that. that. Uh, Yakumo definitely showing that bit of protectiveness is, uh, is a very sweet yeah, side the, to her. The amount of... With the as extreme a character as Tenma is, it yes. makes sense that there would be a complex in the traditional sense, not in the anime sense. Right. Right? Where it's the, oh, fuck. You know, right? Like, my sister, that's a whole enchilada, right? Yeah. You know, and maybe also the reason why she doesn't like it when her sister is talked down to is because it's the, yes, I don't like to think about the fact of how dependent my sister is and, like, how she'd be useless without me. And, oh, God, what do I do? You know, but. Horace, you don't understand her tragic backstory. When our parents both died tragically. Yep. She did My dead she mother. Could. You feel she, bad now? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> After God, that cat, that I'm just thinking ghost just stories. Unlocked like, ghost story it's, stuff for it's, us it's, in a whole and, way. and we got psychic powers in the same episode, right? Like, it's, uh, it's just, it's there. God. Like, yeah. Oh, but y'all, mm-hmm. thank you so much for watching this episode's reaction and discussion. If you want to see the next episode's reaction and discussion right now, though, go check out the link in the description below for our Patreon. You can get on early access there. You can watch full-length timer reactions there, and all this comes with Discord access, so you can chat with us in the community there about this show, about anime in general. And also be sure to check out my Baldur's Gate 3 Let's Play on Twitch. And if any of that interests you, we'll see you there. But until then, we're Semblance of Sanity. I'm Caleb. I'm Jacob. And we'll see you all next time.